Hello everyone and welcome back to Command and Conquer. So last time we went to Albania and rescued Dr. Mobius and this time we are actually going to do the same but in Bulgaria, which of course is completely different. Come on. There we go. GDI funded research shows the following incidents of Tiberium related illnesses. Respiratory ailments. Reproductive ailments. Immune system ailments. Tiberium related deaths. Spores emitted by Tiberium infected plants appear to be a source of Tiberium related illnesses. The world scientific community is focusing its research on this deadly spore. Tiberium is a new life form. Quite simply put, it seems to be adapting the Earth's terrain, foliage, and environment to suit its own alien nature. If this is the case, ladies and gentlemen, we are facing a killer beyond that of our most turbulent nightmares. It is not an exaggeration to state that the future of the entire planet may be in jeopardy. May God have mercy on our souls. Sorry to interrupt your briefing, Commander, but we need your help now. Kane discovered we were hiding Mobius, and he's throwing everything at us but the kitchen sink. It's up to you to mobilize the strike force. Acquire Mobius and rendezvous with the rescue choppers. Mobius may be crazy, but he holds the key to this Tiberium riddle. Good luck. Reinforcements have arrived. Okay, here we are. So, here are reinforcements. So, let's first start by repairing our base. Oh, and we get two bit advanced guard towers this time. So, here, let's repair. Yep, and then was our transport. That's alright. So let's build some engineers. Unit ready. Building. Yes, affirmative. Unit ready. Building. And let's also build another ABC. Yes, Place our Unit tank here and our yes, mammoth here. And Unit rocket out. guy behind them. Well, not a rocket guy, but our mobile Warning. artillery. Um, let's hide Mobius here. Yes, sir. Moving out. Moving out. So here we go. Out. Going to use the same Moving cheap out. rush tactic. Because the computer is a cheating bastard, so I might as well cheat too. So let's slow down the game a little bit. Affirmative. Affirmative. And this looks good. Moving out. Affirmative. Moving out. Affirmative. Yep, this is not base. Obelisk of Light. Get one engineer and let's... Why did, you, why did all of you... Come on. Why did all of you... Okay, yeah, that was a failure. Doesn't matter. So, let's get some more engineers. Yep, these guys don't ch stand a chance. Let's maybe build a second one. Oh, there's actually quite a lot of guys. So let's keep our toss and shed. Whoa, whoa. That is a lot of. A lot of materials they're throwing at us. Yeah, but this is a pretty good bottleneck. So yeah, they rebuilt the airfield. That's alright. Yes, you 
Got it. Not building capture. Yes, affirmative. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Yep, yeah, there we go. So let's go for... Let's just go for the handoff knot. Maybe we can destroy it, maybe we can't. No, it doesn't really matter. So we got some money. That's good. So... Actually... We might even try this again and destroy. Actually... Oh yeah. So let's let's go for these these defenses here. And uh, not these defense well, they are defense, but let's go for those. For those the Sam sites, so those are out of the way. Because for some reason not managed to build all these Sam sites pretty much outside the GDI base, but didn't well did attack the GDI base but didn't even manage to destroy it. This. this whole setup is just weird. But I'm okay with that. So anyway, as I was saying, let's destroy the SAM site here. With everybody. Yep. The SAM sites are tough. They actually get less tough when they are open and shooting something, but it's not the case here, so... Yeah, we have to do it the hard way. Come on. Ooh, not soldier. And they're still building loads and loads of infantry, because that's pretty much the only thing they can build now, but I'm okay with that. As long as they're not building masses of of uh, medium tanks. Oh, uh, light tanks, sorry. Not can't build medium tanks. So, what do I want? So I do have enough power, so I don't need to repair this, this power plant here. So yeah, I think I'll be able to build another APC. It's good for exploration, and APCs are always useful, because they are also pretty good against infantry. They can crush them, they have a machine gun that's pretty good, so let's go for another APC. Let's explore this area here. And yeah, my engineer rush could have been a little more efficient, but it did the job. You can do engineer rushes and almost all the missions, but I don't want to cheese too much. Ooh, money crate. So yeah, didn't want to overdo it. Hello. I'm coming for you, and I crushed almost all of them. Ah, delicious. Ooh, they come from this side now. Not good, but my gut house should should have this un unless those rock guys stay out of range which they might actually do because they're because they're mean spirited so yeah. okay that went okay yeah not base here has two obelisks these obelisks apparently were not powered when when i initially attacked the base but it seems that at this point Oh, more, more infantry. At this point, they actually do have power because I got a couple of their buildings, which is a little bit odd, but alright, I guess. So, oh. more turrets. So let's let's build more medium tanks and let's go for the harvester because obviously they can't build the harvester. So that should solve all our issues. Here we go. More infantry from the east. That's okay, as long as I have small artillery, which I can't, still can't build on my side. So, come on, attack them! And my gutter almost died. Not good. So let's take this guy along because. APCs are good against infantry, as I've said about a hundred times. And this guy here too. So let's go here. Try to avoid uh, this turret here. And you guys please go here. 
Come on, just cross. It's not that difficult. Yep, pass finding from the mid 90s. So there comes the harvester. Been waiting for you, Ooh, and they get they get mad. That's okay. I got this. So let's just return to base and have some run into my defenses. Might even crush a couple of guys on the way. Let's get this guy here into position. Um, this guy here behind, yes, behind the mammoth. Thank you very much. Yes, and they're all running over the Tiberium field. How very convenient. Yeah, they're almost dead one, dead on arrival, pretty much. Yeah. That went pretty well. They should be out of money soon. Well, their Tiberium sil silos are still filled relatively well, but. Should be out of money soon, so while these guys here are defending, I might as well take these guys to destroy some more Sam sites. And I think the sprite here is actually a sprite for Professor Einstein from Red Alert. Yeah, they recycle a lot of stuff for Red Alert, but Red Alert was, was from what I know, it was intended to be more of an expansion pack, and then it became a full fledged sequel, even though one that recycled a lot of graphics, but. Nope, more guys come from that direction. But it came out yeah, not even two years later, so it's kind of excusable that it's not... Yeah, come on. Yeah, there we go. That's exactly what I wanted to do. That it's not like a completely new game, it's completely new graphics and everything. And it's still a very good game. I don't really mind if there's no graphical up update, as long as the gameplay is good, as long as the graphics were alright in the first place. So, Obelisk of Light, I don't want to confront those. So, they're almost out of money, so let's just head back to base and go the other way around. And you couldn't even crush those guys, really. Come on, yeah, there we go. That wasn't too difficult. So, probably going to go for the turret next. Um, yes, do I need to repair any tanks? No, not really. They should be fine. Some Wagner music in the background. Probably inspired by Apocalypse Now. So, yeah, let's just go for the turret. I mean, we have to destroy it soon later anyway if you want to destroy that same site, so might as well do it now. So, here we go. Yep, that wasn't too difficult. Yep, here we go. So let's send this guy back to be repaired. And this guy, come on, come down. Then I'm going to attack these turrets. And I want to target their power plants. Because then they should be out of power. Because I really don't want to fight these obelisks. Kind of annoying, they're not they're a little bit fragile but can still do quite a lot of damage. So let's take these guys. Can I attack that base from the north? Mm, not sure. Maybe with artillery. Well the turret can definitely attack me. Yeah, actually let's give that a go. Let's let's be a little bit sneaky. Let's take this guy here along. I don't think artillery can actually outrange turrets. Yeah, artillery is a little bit odd in the earlier Command Conquer games in the sense that it doesn't outrange a lot of units, even though its stick, its stick should be that it does outrange almost everybody. But here it sticks more that it's pretty fragile but has a high damage output, which I guess is accurate. Anyway. So let's give this a go. Yeah, and it actually works, so... Woo! Rocket infantry, not good. So, let's protect this artillery here. Let's do it like this. That should do the job. Yes, 
Yep. Come on, it's just a flamethrower guy. Yep. That's how I like it. Let's do it like this. It's almost like solving a puzzle game. Yeah, and I can actually reach the barracks, or can I? Well, not not really. I barely damage it. So let's go for power plant first. Yeah, repaired. Waste money by repairing it. I'm okay with that. Can these guys attack? Yeah, these guys can reach it too, so excellent. So let's destroy everything here. There we go. Ooh, n now they're really angry. Oh no, my artillery. Yeah, that, that was bound to happen. That's okay. Nope, you can't actually attack. Attack that, so... Come on. Yeah, that's how I like it. And these guys here... This, were driven insane by. Can you leave? No, you can't. So these guys here, they're completely insane. They don't know where to go. That basically... Back pathfinding. Please take that flamethrower guy. Come on. There we go. It's six tanks, and they still need that much time to to kill this flamethrower guy. So bring the APC over and the mammoth tank. These guys look so funny. I wish I still had my artillery because it would be really useful now. And I don't want to sacrifice that tank, so let's do it like this. Where where are you going? Wh what are you guys doing? Stop! St stop immediately! I didn't tell any of you to move like that. Come on, kill him. Oh, maybe not. Okay, these rocket guys finally go for my tanks. That's alright. Got superior firepower. Yeah, that, that one tank's probably going to die. I'm okay with that. So... Let's destroy this turret. There we go, the Sultan. There we go. So let's just destroy these SAM sites because I don't really need to kill all the infantry, even though I probably have to confront them now with a lot of guys. And my, tank, my tanks are really heavily damaged, like most of them are half dead. Yeah, and here we go. And you're safe, of course. I really had to destroy these SAM sites here to have um, a Chinook land here, but yeah, whatever. Mission accomplished. Okay, that was GDI Mission 12 Redux. So thanks for watching, and I shall see you next time. And my leadership was worse this time, but my efficiency was way higher. Again, I'm not really sure what, what that even means. And I lost the build. Yeah, I lost. I think I lost that airstrip. Or did I lose anything else? Yeah, I'm not entirely sure, but never mind. Thanks for watching, and I shall see you next time. Take care and goodbye.